Well, with the goats on display, the legends writing one last chapter. But these All-Stars for Riyadh have something to prove here today, Thomas. They certainly do, Phil. Mbappe again, loving to float out. Through into the middle, and tucking it home on his first shot of the match. It's Lionel Messi. Well, that's the way this game is supposed to go. And that trident, Phil, although it was simplicity by Mbappe, out wide, stretching that back four, touching the ball, allowing Neymar to get involved, and a Messi, this time, Frank's depth in this game. Neymar with the brilliant pass, the trident off and running. There you see Mbappe stretching that back four. Neymar gets close to Messi, just the recognition of space and the timing of Neymar's ball and the finish of Messi is exquisite, a little bent away from the goalkeeper and center back by Neymar, absolutely brilliant, and what a start for PSG and just what Dolce ordered. Messi trying to dribble away from Luis Gustavo, many have tried, many have failed. Now through into the middle, Ronaldo, and a sprawling save by his former Madrid teammate, Kaylor Navas, denies the equalizer. God, nice interchange there at midfield, Phil, and that's Ronaldo as of old being able to get on the end. Chase, Kun, Ramos over, the two center backs dueling. Korean comes away with it with a nice little flick. Into the middle, Piti. Luis Gustavo keeps it alive. Ronaldo, the shot from the Brazilian. Diving save, Navas. Messi dropping deep. Classic vintage Hakimi right here. Out wide for Hakimi. Sneaks it to the back post. Pops on Neymar. Tries to sneak it through. Veteran fullback always great in the overlap going forward. Chance through. Flag down. Mbappe bursting around the keeper to slot it home. There is VAR, but the flag comes up late anyway. Was it offside? Again, the brilliant first touch of Messi allows him to buy space, and for our vantage point, Phil, that's 100% offside as well. Ronaldo against Hakimi. Makes the run and a hit with Kaylor Navas. The ball sends through. It looks like they've called a penalty against the PSG keeper, but they both come up with a daze. Now, is it a foul in the first place? And if so, Thomas, who's the instigator here? Oh, well, first, Peter Martinez's ball is absolutely brilliant between 12 and 6. And there you see Ronaldo, eyes on the ball. And yes, that is a penalty because Navas does not get anything of the ball and gets Ronaldo's head with some force. Both fist and elbow come through. That's the correct call regards the fact that the PSG players don't particularly care for that, but it is a penalty. And we hope that Ronaldo can continue to play after this. There's the fist for our making no contact with the ball whatsoever place the player that's a hundred percent uh, penalty uh, maybe a little bit of blood they're checking for 12 steps away Ronaldo high into the back corner and we're tied in one only imagine the amount of pressure on the Portuguese International and his strong mindset Phil allows him to equal Messi in his first half. Goal each on the great duress and pressure. He finishes that with strength and power and precision. No chance for Kaylor Navas. Shoelaces half inside of the shoe, which means that he's choosing direction over power, but enough to get it past Navas, 1-1.
Messi and Ronaldo on the score sheet. Messi, near post, smashed away, trying to hold on. Hakimi, two takedowns. And will it be a red card? The first takedown, legitimate perhaps, but they're not deciding to put out a fire with gasoline. Yeah, I just talked about the second phase of Tech of Peace. She's done such a good job, Phil, outside the 80 yard box. This time, a poor touch by Hakimi allows the Saudi All Star team to get away. And then, yes, Bernard becomes the last defender. And that shows you that this is not just a friendly and all-star game. Bernard right there is the last defender with a cynical foul. BT brought down first, but the ball goes to Salem El Dosari, the ex Al man. So maybe a little with each other, but the law is the law, Phil. Messi realizing that this is a red card and right decision being made, but... SG making about 10 million if you believe some of the reports for this friendly here today. Help balance the books a bit. Inside! And that one, shorthanded, will upend the score. Marquinhos celebrates, but did he get a touch? He did distract El Alais, and PSG's back in front. Right, we talked about again short corners. The ability for them to keep possession when their big boys are forward. Both Ramos and Marquinhos starting positions are in the 18-yard box. Mbappe, uh, touch of upside maybe for Fabian. Ball comes in, not a lot of pressure. And Marquinhos does get a nice touch on that one field. Finds the seat and then really, really Swan Lake on that one. Caresses that one far. Counter is on. Neymar, Messi. Neymar brought down by Al Bulahi, but no, says the referee. Again, uh, there is VAR. They'll take a look. Was there enough contact here from the Saudi international? Great cutback. Left foot continues as well. Yeah. And I tell you, is he is dragging contact, the hook? More than enough contact, Phil, to make this. A red card and penalty, left foot on the shin and ankle of Neymar. Potential friendly, according to the law, and this is according to the law, a penalty as well. He has seen it. Now, was he reaching for the pocket as well? We'll find out. Back onto the field for this penalty. Denied Argentina in the World Cup. What will he do against the Brazilian here? A slow roll! And over goes the Saudi keeper to keep it to a one-goal game. Out. But when he is on, he can be lethal. But Kaylor Navas probably saw more of these than almost any keeper on the planet. Into the wall, off Marquinhos. The rebound trickles through. Poked back, and it will be gathered by the Riyadh Stars. The wall did their job, Phil, very brave as well. Nice by Aldassari. Whipped inside, glancing header off the post. Still loose for Ronaldo! And second tries the charm. A brace for the Portuguese legend in his new hometown. is Ronaldo, the ability, the flick in the air, the eyes are open, he wants to go far post, and then the follow-up, he's on sides by the way, brilliant, between two of the best center backs in the world, Marquinhos and Ramos, Ramos cannot clear the rebound, but the header of Ronaldo, that flick header, and then the ability for him to follow, instinctively sniff out the rebound right here, after a mistake by Ramos from a tough angle with his left foot, overpowers Navas. Woo!
Now the two Riyadh Derby rivals teaming up and now drawn with PSG. By the way, in that Derby, Al Hilal currently in second place. 59 wins, 48 for Al Nasser. Today they're working together. Mbappe gets around the defense in front for Sergio Ramos. And hey, one Real Madrid legend scores. Why not another? And eventually does come. And just like Marquinhos, Ramos just makes a hard run. This one is on the ground. No chance. But I'm telling you, both center backs <laughs> have excelled inside the opposing opponent 18 yard box. Obviously, all the hard work done by Mbappe getting away from Abdul Hamid and then a good ball in to the streaking near post Ramos. And yes, why not? 3 2. Marquinhos and Ramos both in the score sheet. Cristiano from the corner, driven in the middle, and it's the Korean Zhang, Jung Su Zhang. Three goals for his national team, and this will be one to remember. Ball kept it alive for the first goal. He's there again, and just gets ahead of Ramos. And talk about a flick header. No chance for Navas. Ramos is Messi. Quickly for Neymar, threads it for Mbappe. Back to the middle for Messi. Blocked away, but off the arm. And back to the spot we go. El Bulai couldn't get out of the way. His argument is in a natural position. Bang, bang. Nah, hard to argue. Yeah, it comes very fast. And yes, the arm is away from the body, Phil. It starts high. He tries to actually bring it in. Crowd. 11 meters away, and one goal the distance. Mbappe scores. He's on the score sheet, and back in front. The next generation makes its presence felt. That's a great point, Phil. Obviously, we're talking. Ronaldo will exit. The Al Hilal midfielder, Mohamed Kano, will check in. And a nice round of applause for the Portuguese legend. Let's see. And it will be Messi. So equaling Cristiano Ronaldo on the clock. And both goats maybe not ready for the pasture as the two Argentines say hello. But they are ready to watch this one from the sidelines. He has been through the opening 60 minutes plus. Mutual respect. Now with some of the youngsters on, they also have something to prove. Taliska, the turn. Donnarumma hops over to make the stop. Luis Gustavo almost stole it, but he leaves the back door open. And now a charge for Ekatike around Abdul Hamid. Off the fingertips of Mohamed al -Ais. And Hugo Ekatike's scoring run continues. It's 5-3 PSG. He drives that one upper V far post. Well executed free kick. Or sorry, counter, obviously. Of a player that was replaced very early in the last game because of not playing particularly well. In the third minute, Ronaldo, Marquinhos, Ronaldo again, Ramos. Looking for Taliska to add his name to the list, but it just whistles wide. Yeah, I can't hit the frame, but he's got such a good strike with a left foot. In the African Championship, as Morocco withdrawing. Through ball for Mati Pereira. Cuts through Bichiabu, Pereira through, Carillo. Back and up and over. Oh, bouncing back towards Pereira. Otaif. Off to Liska. And rifled up and over. So close. Sneaks it inside on the turn. Taliska 
Paliska, goal! And what a way to bring down the curtain. He's been starving for one, and that was a feast. With that cultivated left foot from distance. This time, through traffic. Donnarumma, she's up late. Also, just gets away from him. The pace, power, position. Brilliantly executed. Abdul Rahman Al Jassim, the referee, brings the whistle up and ends a Cinderella night. Five for the final in this last dance between the legends. Hope you enjoyed it.